A lot of us come into recovery programs and they always talk about, or a lot of them talk about having faith or believing in something outside of yourself. And you know alcoholics, they're all crazy about that, right? Oh, I can't believe in that, that's God shit. I can't believe in God. Well, I'm not talking about God. I'm talking about having faith and having a belief that the program you're in is gonna help you with your recovery, okay? Because you know something? You already had faith. You already had belief in your life. You just didn't know it. You thought you just did everything on your own, but you really didn't. You really didn't. So let me point it out to you. Faith, for starters. You have a hard day at work. Maybe the wife's getting on your case, or you're a failure, you're up in jail, handcuffs, or you're like me. You're a total loser. You can't control your life. But you know something? Back in the back of your brain, you say to yourself, you know, when I get home and I have that little drinky, I have that bottle of booze, or, or if I have that bottle of beer, I'm gonna feel better. But you know what that is? Let me tell you what that is. I already know what that is. That's faith. You don't have it in your hands. You don't have it anywhere around you, but you're thinking about it. That's faith. Thinking that it's gonna be better. Your life is going to be better. And then when you get home a couple hours later or an hour later, and you take that drink of booze or whatever your drink was, mine was beer, and you suck it back and it goes down, it's nice and warm and it goes down to the stomach and all of a sudden, all that stress and all those problems of life go away instantaneously. And you know what happens then? You believe that that will help you. You believe it. So when it comes to your recovery, you gotta kinda think of the same. They get in the same way. When you're having a rough day, when the world's caving in on you and you think you're gonna drink, or you want to drink, or you're craving a drink, or you're freaking out because you want to drink, just have a little faith. If you get to that meeting, just get to that meeting, it's gonna be okay. That's faith. Then when you get there and you talk to somebody or you work your program a little bit within that meeting, you start to believe because you start to settle down in that belief, that reassurance comes in and you say to yourself, much like you said to the booze, it's gonna be okay, I'm gonna be all right, and I go home and have a great sleep and tomorrow's gonna be a great day. The same thought process when it comes to faith and it comes to belief happens to you in recovery. But the problem is, it takes effort in recovery. And when we drank, we're so used to it, we didn't even know we're doing it. We didn't even know we're doing it. We all do it, we all did it. The booze helped us, and we believe that the booze helped us through our lives. That's why we became, one of the major reasons we became alcoholic. And you know, faith, that your life will get better from working a program of AA or whatever it is, and eventually you'll start to believe that your life is getting better and you don't need to drink and use drugs to cope in your life. You can just use a 12-step program or whatever program you're in to help you out on your daily basis. It really works, it really does. I believe in the 12 steps of recovery. I have faith in the program of recovery it will help me out whatever comes my way, whatever comes my way. But you know, it takes time. Faith and belief in a program one day at a time is organic. So it takes more time for us to realize it and get the benefits of it. When it comes to alcohol, it's instantaneously. We just have to drink it and that warm and calm feeling comes over us instantly, okay? So give us some time and just realize, get a little bit of faith and you will start to believe that whatever program you're working is helping you out in your recovery one day at a time, okay? Thanks a lot for stopping by. My name is Terry G. This is an Alcohol Free Life Channel all the way from Jamaica, come on. Having a great vacation. It's a beautiful morning and I'm having a great time. One of the gifts of being sober is for me, I've been to the Caribbean probably 25 times in the last 10 years. I love it. I love my life. It's a great life, okay? So be happy, don't worry. Subscribe to my channel, smash that like button, and I'll see you next week, okay? I'll just give you a little bit of view of that ocean. Look at that ocean. Okay? It's hard to believe, it's hard to have no faith that there is a higher power out there, right? Eh? Isn't that beautiful, right? Eh? Isn't that great, Hey, eh? Ciao for now, bye-bye.